<laughs> Good job welcoming your friends back to our library. So the book that we are going to read today, friends, is titled, Don't Let the Pigeon Drive the Bus, Words and Pictures by Mo Willems. What's Willems? That's, that's the author and the illustrator's last name. Do you know this story? Yeah. Yeah. So he's going to drive a bus. Hmm. I remember when I was younger, I used to get on the bus when I lived in New York City. Libby, have you ever been to New York City? Yeah. I went to see Grandpa in New York City. You did go see Grandpa in New York City. And there's so many different ways to get around in New York City. You can take a taxi or you can take the subway. But we've never been on the subway because we usually drive, right? Yeah, but those are different ways that you can get around. But today, we're going to focus on the bus and we're going to focus on this pigeon. pigeon. That's right. Are you ready to jump in? Yep. <gasps> There's a letter here. Let's read this letter. Hi, I'm the bus driver. Listen, I've got to leave for a little while. So can you watch things for me until I get back? Thanks. Oh, and remember, don't let the pigeon drive the bus. I thought he'd never leave. Hey, can I drive the bus? No. Please? No. I'll be careful. No. I tell you what, I'll just steer. No. My cousin Herb drives a bus almost every day. No! He thinks he knows how to drive a bus because his cousin knows how to drive a bus. True story! No! Vroom, vroom, vroomy, vroom, vroom! No! Pigeon at the wheel! No! That didn't work either. No! I never get to do anything! Hey, I've got an idea. Let's play drive the bus. No. I'll go first. No. We can't even take turns? No. Come on, just once around the block? No. Really quick? No. I'll be your best friend? No. Hey, how about I give you five bucks? No. Hmm, no fair. I bet your mom would let me. No. What's the big deal? No! It's just a bus. No! I have dreams, you know. No! Fine! Fine! Let me drive the bus! No! I'm back! You didn't let the pigeon drive the bus, did you? No! Great! Thanks a lot! Oh. Bye. Hey. He's thinking if he couldn't drive the bus, maybe he could drive a truck. What do you think? Is that a good idea? Nah, I don't think so either. <laughs> the end. What happened at the beginning of the story? The bus driver was there. He left and the, the pigeon came. And he came right back and he said, uh-oh. Wait, but you skipped something. So when the bus driver left, what did that pigeon want to do? Drive the bus. So we said no. He said no. So did he get what he want? No. So we had fun reading, don't let the pigeon drive the bus today. So what do we need to tell our friends? Bye, friends, and let them give you glad, Yeah, good job.